Hi students, this is your Professor K from Mwell Education and in this lecture uh, we are going to discuss the firstly the observations of chemical reaction. Now you understand what is chemical reaction when change happens that is chemical reaction but, but what type of change? Here for this we will observe change in state. Solid may be converted into liquid, liquid may be converted into gas, this type of change. So uh, this is the change in state. Second change is change in color. There can be, there may be or may not be change in color. So in chemical reaction, change in color happens. As you have seen when uh, wood is burnt, so it is going to change its color. So that is the change in color. Next, evolution of gas. Some gas may or may not generate, but generally in chemical reactions, gases uh, are generated and the change in temperature. You very well understand, obviously, that if the temperature is going to change, some chemical reaction is going to happen. So, I think you understand the observations of chemical reaction, how to observe that chemical reaction is occurring or not, except these number of parameters are there, but these four are important in this class to discuss. Okay. So, next, what is chemical equation? So, that is our main uh, focus that what is chemical equation for example i will clear you with an example of your syllabus so when magnesium ribbon burned in oxygen it is converted into magnesium oxide now this is a lengthy statement so we can uh, write a word statement or a word equation like this magnesium plus oxygen will give you magnesium oxide so that is much simpler than this particular statement this is only one example but in next videos we are going to have number of chemical reactions we have to balance them and lot of tasks so this is a word equation so now you know but what is chemical equation now this is chemical equation the symbol mg for magnesium o2 for oxygen and mgo for magnesium oxide and one more thing what are reactants and products uh, this is an arrow the left side of the arrow will describe the reactants means reactants are going to react and they will form out the products so the right side of the arrow will give you the products i think it is much clear to you because it, it is already clear to you in your previous classes so these are reactants these are products and this is chemical equation and uh, one missing thing is here which i will discuss further we can also write down the state for example, if this is solid, you can write here S in brackets. Okay. So that, that thing we will discuss. And so that's all about this lecture. This is your Professor K. And please subscribe our channel if you are liking us. And obviously for some more good stuff in future. Thank you.